Now we will be doing the only packet tracer in module 5, which is investigate STP load perfection. So I think this packet tracer is not a configuration activity. I think we just need to show up. The objective of this packet eraser is to investigate STP loop prevention. So in this lab, you will observe spanning tree port states and watch the spanning tree convergence process. So describe the operation of spanning tree protocol. Explain how STP prevents switching loops while allowing a redundancy in a switch networks. Okay. So in this activity, you will uh, use packet eraser to observe the operation of STP in a simple switch network that has redundant path. So as you can see, we have here a redundant link to S2. So we have two paths. Part 1 is observe the controlling spanning tree instance. So ping from PC1 to PC2 to verify connectivity between the host your ping should be successful. Okay, let's ping this one. One two dot one six eight dot one dot one one. So we are getting a reply. So use spanning tree status on on each switch. So use spanning tree villain one to command to gather information about the spanning tree status of each switch. So complete table. For the purpose of the activity, only consider information about the gigabit trunk ports. So the past. Ethernet ports are access ports that have end devices connected and not part of the inter-switch trunk base spanning through. Okay. So we see gigabit Ethernet ports when connecting switches. Okay. Switch one. Uh, let's see. Spanning through VLAN one. So we'll start with All for the span in VLAN 1. On the switch, we have the gigabit is both forward, then the root bridge is. So it is not the root bridge. No. So it is not the, the root bridge. We just copy this. So both forward for gigabit and one and two, both forward. So the gigabit O uh, O two is a root, root port status, alright. But it's not a root bridge; it's the root port. Then designated for the S three. So. Uh, Obviously, it is a block path. So the gigabit 0 slash 2 is block. So it's alternative uh, port. And the one is it's the root. So it's also not the root bridge. Okay. And as you can see, this bridge is the root. Switch right here. Then all the ports. About gigabit Ethernet are both forward ports for the forwarding ports. Okay, next so observe spanning tree convergence. Remove the connection between S1 and S2. Okay, open the CLI window on switch and issue the command show spanning tree. In the CLI window, open select the delete tool from. Okay, we just need to delete this one. Okay. 
Then open na sila yung door is key and show me. Okay. Still block. Okay, observe sa nito pag kikilo na tayo kasi lang si Chi. Okay. You just need to wait until this orange become green. Okay. So you just need to issue this again. As you can see, the gigabit zero slash two is not uh, alternate port, alternate path, but it is now. Okay. It's now on forward. It's not block. Okay. So the block state now a forwarding state. Okay, we'll just need to ping PC1 to PC2 to verify that we still have the connection. And we're getting a reply. So this path user have not has not it's not having a completion process here, completion score. So I think that's it.